All right, guys, we made it to Nathan Bedford Forest State Park. This is the interpretive center. Got to go in and pay for some firewood and then head down to the campsite. Man, this is gorgeous. A heck of a view. Go over here That's not a pretty sight. I mean, look at that. That is gorgeous. Alright, we gotta go get to camp, set up camp. We just had to pay for the firewood and uh, get things going. Just here for the night, but look at that. Isn't that gorgeous. That fishing boat looks like a canoe out there, it's so big. All right, we'll get to camp. All right, so I got camp set up. Um, good omen or bad omen that an eagle flew over camp while I was setting up the tent. You tell me. Got the gazelle up for the first time this year. I haven't set the the uh, tent up or the umbrella up for say right now. I'm not going to. Might later. I don't know. But. We had an eagle while I was putting up that tent fly over the campsite. How cool. So I'm just eating a little snack and drinking a little first cup of coffee. You may recognize this site because this is the site I stayed in the last time I was here. It's like 34. I like this site. It's close to the bathroom, not far. I'm being quiet because I'm one of probably six here this weekend. And we're all staying on the same side. But anyway. Coffee and woods. That's all I need. And I got the woods right there. We'll go down and look at the creek here in a little bit and see if there's any water flowing. I was kind of worried. Coming this way from Nashville, two of them rivers duck and buffalo so we're way over their banks but i'm not i didn't see anything coming in here that would lead me to believe you know they had flooding issues well we had pretty good rain thursday into friday morning we'll see but right now i'm just going to enjoy it and relax do have wood for a fire later so be back later supper time six o'clock so i'm about to go behind those trees over there if it can get dark I already got i did put the umbrella up so i can hang my lights having chili pie for supper tonight whoa it's a good thing i'm the only one sleeping in that tent anyway things gone good um forgot a couple of things luxuries uh, always bring a wireless bluetooth speaker with me and i forgot it but um eh, oh well but um yep fixing to dig into this chili pie and i'll clean up dishes and everything and then be done for the night food wise well except for snacks i mean we got snacks we got snacks I am solo. Everything went great setting up. I didn't have any problems. Um, it's really quiet. Even with the people that are here, it's really quiet. So I'm trying to stay quiet. All right, guys, that's it. I'll be back in a little bit. Pretty good about five o'clock it is 5 42 
I went to bed I don't know, it was probably close to 10. Um, yeah, went to bed pretty close to 10. Slept pretty well all night. I got one time, had to go out and water a tree. And then 5 o'clock hit and I had to do it again. <laughs> um, but, everything gear-wise worked great. Me wise didn't work worth the crap, but we'll get past it. So I've got an update video I'm going to do on a product that I've been using this trip. Realize how well this thing works for its size, but that'll be to come. But uh. I guess I haven't given it its full due until now and realized how well it works. But I'm going to kind of pack everything, sleeping bag, roll up the pad and everything. I'm dressed for the day. Mid 10 Outdoors hoodie. Down below. Get you one or two. I was a little warm last night actually this sleeping bag I forgot how warm that sleeping bag is but I slept good back's a little stiff this morning yeah anyway I want to pack up some things in here I'll try to stay quiet because 7 o'clock is you're supposed to be technically quiet from 10 to 7 in the state parks. So I'm going to sneak out here in a little bit. I'm going to build a raging fire. Probably not raging, but anyway. Build a fire. It's not that cold. Um, I fired the heater up for about 3 or 4 minutes last night. Took the edge off the tent. And I haven't had it on since. Hoodies keep them plenty warm. Um, but I'm going to have to fix some coffee. My special meal that one YouTuber will not like. Maybe two. Alright. <clears throat> I dedicate this breakfast to my buddy, my friend, South Carolina. Shannon, Swamp Stalker, spamming eggs. Mmm. As you can see, it's getting brighter. Um, I looked at the phone. This, these little gusts of wind we're having is nothing yet. But it's coming. And I want to try to get done. Hmm. Thank buddy. Shannon. I mean, you don't know what you're missing. But I want to try to get done. Get the tent down before the real wind gets here. So. There's that. So if I get done eating. I can do my dishes and everything. And I can take that down while the dishes are drying. <coughs> Get the truck loaded. I'm in no real hurry today. But I don't want to fight the wind putting taking that down. Shannon, you don't know what you're missing, man. It's spam. <laughs> I'm gonna get this done. I'll bring it back later.
Okay, so it happened again. Dad blame eagle flew back over. And I'm, I, I, uh, I heard him coming from that direction and he flew back over that direction. So I'm gonna keep an eye out guys. If I see him flying, I'll try him on camera, but I missed him. Bigger than crap. I heard him coming and I couldn't figure out where he was. No, I didn't think to grab the camera. And you could have seen him flying over, fly over. But I heard him call out and there he went. But uh, pretty cool, pretty cool. People camping beside me said he was all over the place here yesterday, flying around. So, anyway. Now I remember why I do this. I was second guessing myself last night, but seeing that eagle is why I do this. Seeing that deer walk up in a camp one time, why I do it. Cup of coffee number two. All right, I'm gonna get these dishes done while they're drying, I'm gonna take the tent down. And uh, now I'm excited. This is why I do this. Seeing that eagle fly over. Special, something special. All right guys, so I'm officially torn down. And uh, I headed out. Well, I'm headed away from the campgrounds, I think. I think. Um, yeah, pretty well done. But, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I appreciate everybody that watches. Appreciate everybody that's tuned in. To the two people I met here. Um, great talking to you. And hope you enjoyed the video that I put together while I was here. It was nice meeting you. Love meeting people. Between meeting the people and seeing the wildlife that's that's why i do this and that that's what means everything so till the next one guys be prepared we'll see you on the next one later <laughs>